Hey friends, how's it going? I wanted to show you today our underhand throwing game that can be played right here on the steps of your house. So as you can see, I am in the stairwell of my house and I have numbers that are on cards for today. So I'm gonna show you how our cards with numbers are going to be a part of our throwing game for today. Now, of course, whenever you are throwing an object, you need to make sure that it's soft in order for all of us to stay safe for today. So I have chosen some objects in my house that are safe and soft to throw so we do not hurt anything in our house or ourselves in the process. So right here, I have two pairs of socks that we are going to need for our game for today. You can also use other pieces of equipment that are just as soft or something that might be a little bit easier to throw, but this was just something I had nearby that I thought would be good to throw for today. So what I'm gonna do right here is I'm gonna take my socks, I'm going to do an underhand throw. So I step and I throw up the steps. You will notice it landed on one of the steps. So I'm gonna walk on up. You can also choose to run up as well. So as you can see, it landed on this step right here next to the number 11. So what that means is Mr. Shields got 11 points. Now it's time for player two to do their throwing. However, since I'm by myself for today, I'm actually going to also throw for player two as well. So let's see how I do. So I step and throw. Let's see how many points I got here. Wow, almost to the top. So I got 13 points on that one. As a bonus for today, if you want to make our activity a little bit more challenging, you can always use something like this. I have a small soft ball that you can use. Whatever step the ball lands on and stays on is going to be the number of points that you receive. So friends, a couple things to remember before we wrap up our video for today. If you toss your sock and it goes all the way to the very top, believe it or not, you do not get any points if it lands all the way at the top. So try to get the highest number of points you can. You can choose to keep score or you can choose to play for fun. Remember, if you are keeping score, you're gonna have to do a little bit of math in order to add up those points, but I encourage you to try it. I think it'd be really, really fun. So feel free to find a friend and have a great, great day. I look forward to seeing all the awesome things that you get to do in the future. So take care, stay healthy, my friends. And of course, make sure you stay active.